May 1st, 2011, Osama bin Laden, the mastermind of the 9-11 attack on America, is at last within the sights of United States Special Forces. There was this uh, very important lead with regards to uh, the couriers, and almost immediately it raised great suspicions. My first reaction when they described the compound in Abbottabad was that we had something very unusual. The number of people that we saw in the compound seemed to match the number of family members that might be with bin Laden. Once the intelligence had reached a point where there was a, at least a higher confidence level about the possibility, uh, the next uh, question we asked was, uh, what should we do operationally? The president is briefed regularly, but all information is tightly controlled. The focus ultimately fell on the raid option in order to not only be able to go in, uh, but to determine whether, in fact, it was bin Laden. Since it was a uh, covert operation, I was designated as the person to oversee the operation. So we basically set up uh, an operations center at uh, the CIA, and uh, we maintained uh, contact with uh, Admiral McRaven, who was in uh, Afghanistan overseeing the operations. And we were getting regular reports, and uh, we were feeding those back to the White House. was risky because it did involve uh, an operation that had to go a long way into Pakistan. Uh, we clearly had to track it uh, every step of the way. You see something that involves some of the fears about what could possibly go wrong. Suddenly, all of those fears are coming true. When Admiral McRaven indicated a kind of, you know, this is not a problem. These guys are going to do the job. It gave me a sense of confidence. It was a good 15 or 20 minutes of uh, silence in, in the sense of what exactly was going on in there. Those were very long and tortuous moments. Waiting for the word. Now, the code word, Geronimo, came across all of the months of gathering intelligence, all of the questions suddenly were answered in that moment when we heard Geronimo. What was a surprise was that it frankly took as long as it did to finally get bin Laden. You would have hoped that we could have done it earlier, 